Divorces can be long, drawn out cases that go on for years and years. And with that comes the expense and possibly the emotional damage done to the rest of the family. This next act, the legal expert has been sponsored by the Hafner Law Office. And joining me today is family law attorney Mark Hafner. Mark, thanks for joining us. Thanks for having me. Absolutely. I mean, when it comes to divorce or to really a family law case, what people know, need to know, if they were just served papers. Uh, if you were just served papers, the biggest thing that you need to know is this. The clock has started. Yeah. So you've got about 30 days to file responsive pleadings. And even if you hired a lawyer on day 20, it's gonna take them a little while to draft it, get it to you, get it approved, get it signed in front of a notary and submitted. So the sooner you get on it, the better. And it's not a thing that you could just stick your head in the sand and be like, oh, I'm sure it'll work out, you know, we're gonna work it out or anything. What happens is, is um, you do things, as a matter of fact, I've got several of those today. They're called default hearings. If you don't respond in 30 days, the other person's lawyer can go to court and say they've chosen not to participate in this, mm. and then they get whatever they ask for. Ooh. So you well, want to make sure somebody's favor. Exactly. <laughs> so you want to make sure that you are uh, responding and that you're timely and you're on top of what you need to do. And I understand if you don't know what you need to do, but the first thing you need to do is call a lawyer, at least know what you need to do uh, and get things set up. And I'm glad that you said be timely and just to be cognizant that, hey, that your clock has started. Because, yes, there is a common misconception that divorce can take forever, but people also think they happen just like that, too, and that's not the case at all. No, no. My fastest divorces uh, in Missouri generally are about 45 days higher to finish. Wow. Those are uncontested. I've got a contested case I was in court on actually this morning that we are on year four of. So they can oh drag on and on and on and on. That's not the common, thank goodness, but I would say a year to a year and a half is becoming more and more the norm. Uh, where it used to be about a year, I would say it's, it's getting pushed out a little bit longer now. We've never quite uh, re rebounded from the COVID time, so. Well, hey, well, I mean, you are the expert. You're a family law attorney. You specialize in family law cases. This is what makes your practice so unique. Yeah, uh, so I, um, all I do is family law. It's all I've really ever done. It's a very interesting field that there is so much going on with it that you always have to stay on top of what's trending, what's new, new rules, uh, new laws that come out. All these things are constantly changing. And you see some of these attorneys, like I practice everything under the sun. Uh, and quite frankly, I don't know how they do it because I am <laughs> struggling to keep up in one, one my one little area. Uh, just recently, you know, I had a need where I needed to figure out something about personal injury law. And I realized I have no idea what I'm doing. So I called my friend that's a personal injury there attorney. Uh, and he was able to give me fantastic guidance. So I, I knew a little bit more. But yeah, I would say find someone that this is what they specialize in. This is what they do. It's going to make everything so much easier in your life by having someone who is an expert and that this is their field. So it really does make that world of a difference. And you say that it's sometimes better to settle, right? Why do you say that? Settlement does a lot of things. There are three things that a divorce will cost you. Time, money, and stress. The first one is uh, time. I, like I said, if it's uncontested, we can get them done pretty darn quickly. In fact, usually you're done with your part within about 10 to 15 days because you're both going to come in and sign. I just have to wait 30 days after I file to file the final documents. Uh, the money, the longer it goes on, the more it costs. Unfortunately, attorneys aren't cheap. Uh, that's just kind of how it goes. And the more it drags on and the more time and energy it takes of both your attorney and you, uh, you're going to lose more and more money, including having to take off work, go to hearings. The last one that I think is the most underestimated is how much stress is going to cause. Mm -hmm. There is so many people that are up in the air of going, what's happening to my retirement, mm -hmm. my kids, anything. So the stress is a big part of it that you need to also be concerned. And so if you could settle, I Let's highly recommend it. Absolutely. Saving time, energy, and money. You know, I actually just saw it. This is Mark's book. It's called Ex Exit Strategy, Understanding and Handling Your Missouri Divorce. So St. Louis, if you're at home, you've just been served, you're thinking about getting divorced, I'll just pick up the phone and call the Hafner Law Office. That number to dial is 314-261-01. And you can also head online to their website at flatratedivorces.com. We'll make sure you have access to all of this information on our website at studiostl.tv. Don't go anywhere. We'll be right back after this quick break.